How's it going everybody? Today we're gonna be trying Cubecraft's new game mode called Magic and Mayhem. It's gonna be awesome. It's a new RPG game mode. Yeah, uh, do I need to explain any further? It's gonna be cool. Anyways, let's get into this. Alright everybody, we're in- Oh my god, where did we teleport to? There seems to be a few players right here. What's this? Can I pick this up? Oh my- it seems like my levels thing is going up. I don't know what that does though. Okay, let me talk to this guy. Can I talk to you? Oh, he can actually say stuff. Oh, hi there. Welcome to Quintania. It's not often that I get to welcome an actual human. You can see the compass that you have in your menu. Yes, I can- I can see it. If you click on quest in the player menu, it'll show you all your current quests. Okay. You can even try and click on one of them. It will track the quest. Okay, let's try and quest. Alright, let's see. Quests. Quest tracker. Let's uh, let's do that one. There we go. Okay, that was uh, that was pretty easy. Okay, let's go back. I saw another quest. Wonderful wand. What is this? We have to pick up the wand from the ground. Okay, that's pretty easy. I saw a wand right here. Okay, let's pick up the wand. Can we pick it up? Yeah, there we go. Quest complete. Wonderful wand. You have received one hydro wand, level one. Ooh, okay. Should we go or something? I wonder what this wand can do. First of all, let me try right clicking. See what that does. Not enough mana, so we don't have enough mana to use the wand. What about left click? Okay, that's just a. Oh, okay, okay. Let's keep on moving on. There's Perry over here. What do I have to say to you, Perry? Oh, hey, you've got Hydra Wand. Yes, I do. That'll be very useful here. Do you see all these monsters down here? Oh, yep, I see them. Try to attack them using your wand. I believe in you. All right, so to attack them using your wand, we just gotta left click and destroy them, right? Oh, yeah, this is cool. Okay, die, Axolotls, please. Yeah, there we go. Oh, okay, so our levels thing is our mana. Oh my god, what was that? They can obviously attack us back. That is not good. What are these? Water Essence. I don't know what that does yet. We'll have to figure that out. Ooh, what is this? This is, uh, Axolotl shell leggings. Okay, I'll put those on. I'm gonna go talk to Perry again. I see you've attacked some of those horrible monsters and gather some spirit. That's really cool. Now, I think you should be able to find something in the player menu to use your spirit on. Oh, okay, so it's like a level up thing. Ah, uh, yes, it should be under the attributes. Use your spirit to upgrade your max mana. Oh, that's what it's used for. Okay, so upgrade attributes. Okay, max mana. Here we go. Let's upgrade our max mana. Okay, confirm. What else can we upgrade? Max mana regeneration. Let's upgrade that too. Okay, let's start killing more of these axolotl things. Let's keep on moving on. All right, there's Gerald. What does Gerald have to say to us? Ah, there you go. Now there's probably this other ability that your wand can do. Try it out. Okay, so that's probably our right click, right? Let's go down here. Let's use Whirlpool. Okay, what does this do? Ooh, okay. That's pretty good. I got more shelling. Ooh, this is a level four. Okay, okay, let's pick up some of the XP here. Yeah, there we go. Okay, how much spirit we have? We have 275 spirit. Okay, let's upgrade our stuff. So what can we upgrade? What are our elemental attributes? Frost damage. What do we need for this? Okay, we need a frost. Oh, okay. So I have two water essence right now, so we can upgrade the water thing. Water damage and water resistance. We'll upgrade one water damage. There we go. Then we'll upgrade one water resistance. All right, now we can buy the generic attribute stuff. So critical hit damage and luck. I'm gonna upgrade max mana. There we go. Okay, I'm gonna upgrade everything to level five. So we'll get this to level five. There we go. Let's go kill some more of these axolotl things over here. I'm sorry, axolotl, but you must die. Okay, we got some more water essence. That's actually pretty cool. Oh, we got another chest plate. Okay, what armor do we have? We have a chest plate and leggings, and that's pretty much it. I wonder how many times I can use my whirlpool. Basically, it's just until I can regen it. I think that's enough killing the axolotls for now. We almost have like a thousand spirit, actually. Hold on. Let's upgrade our attributes. All right, so let's upgrade regeneration. There we go. Let's upgrade everything to level five first because we want to have a balanced upgrade. Then crit hit damage. I wonder if we're going to have enough to upgrade everything to level five. Okay, yeah, we don't have enough. Okay, we've upgraded a lot though. I'm not going to lie. Okay, let's see what else we can upgrade. Elemental upgrades. Let's check water damage. How much do we need? So we need 37 spirit. I only have four, so we could just kill like one of these things and we should be good. Oh my god. <laughs> I didn't realize there was more than one there. Okay, yeah, now we have enough. All right, let's go to upgrade attributes, elemental upgrades, and let's upgrade our water damage. There we go. How much damage do we do? 10 damage. That's actually quite a bit. I'm not gonna lie. Okay, I think we're strong enough to move on to the next area now. So how do we get up to the next area? Do we have to go over here? Oh, okay, so it's like a parkour thing. All right, head over here. Hopefully we're strong enough. I'm not gonna lie. Let's talk to Pepper. What do I need from Pepper? Let me unlock this door for you now. I heard that there's a special shrine in the room next to this one. You should talk to Noah for more information there. Let's look at her quest now. I haven't checked my quest. Okay, so let's talk to Noah first. Let's keep going. All right, Noah, what's up, man? What's up, Noah? I've been studying this shrine and I figured out that if you interact with it, it shows you something really cool. Okay, okay. There's also a warp here. It can do amazing things. Go ahead and try both out. Try upgrading your wand while you're at it. I think we upgraded our wand already. Water shrine warper. Okay, what does this do? This is a warper. It allows you to teleport to other warpers in the universe. Quest water warper. Oh, what is this? Is this the shrine? I'm pretty sure that's the shrine. 
mind. Oh, yeah, there we go. Okay, upgrade one. We need one spirit and one water essence. So we don't have a water essence. We'll just go back and kill some of the axolotls over here. Let's upgrade Lux level five. We'll probably get more water essence if we do this too. All right, please die now. Unfortunately, I haven't gotten another water essence yet. I, I kind of regret spending it. Oh, yes. Okay, we found another water essence. Oh, we got level four boots too. That's good. Now we have enough stuff to actually... Okay, let's actually pick up another water essence. Oh, there's even more water essences over here. And we got a level four helmet too. So now we've got full... Sh what is it called? Axolandal... I don't even know how to pronounce that. But we have full leather armor, basically. Now that we have enough water essence, we can actually upgrade our stuff at this, uh, what is it called? Water shrine? I'm pretty sure. All right, let's upgrade this. So what does it do? It lowers the cooldown for Whirlpool, and it does more damage. So let's upgrade our wand. Yeah, there we go. Okay, so we got some new quests. I want to see if I can upgrade our wand again. Okay, let's upgrade our wand again. We actually have enough, so yeah, there we go. All right, let's keep on moving on. What is this up here? Does this, like, lead me to a new place? Oh, there's fire here now. Can I jump over this? Okay, no, I can't. <laughs> I can't jump over this. All right, what do we have to do? Let's check our quest. All right, fire extinguisher. I should use my wand to extinguish the fire blocking my path. Okay, so we just gotta extinguish the fire. That should be pretty easy. We use our water wand. Okay, that actually works. All right, there we go. Who's Cubit? I'm gonna talk to Cubit first. All the stuff that's going on, it's real. First, the evil bunny tries to take over Cubecraft, and now this weird corruption and these unknown creatures invade our world. Yeah, that certainly is weird. The Quintanians know nothing, though. They haven't seen any of it. I only heard it after the Yornham, Yorn I don't know how to pronounce it, and the Alinor. Those poor dwarven and feyans don't even know what's happening to them. Parts of their worlds are completely corrupted and inhabited by creatures they've never seen before. They look like dragons as we know in their fairy tales and animated movies. Yeah, it's certainly very weird. The fans, on the other hand, are dealing with the creatures that look like orcs. They call them wergs. We can't understand anything they're saying and their worlds don't seem to be in our universe. That's all we know. All right, let's talk to Captain Biggest now. All right, what do you have to say? Whoa, how did you just get out of there because I'm cool. <laughs> what? A hydro wand? Use that thing to put out the fire? <sighs> okay. Maybe you can't help us after all. A lot has been happening recently. There's been strange things going on in our universe. Other worlds have been having major issues and never seen before monsters, and they've been causing mayhem in those worlds. And it's not just there. We've been having our own issues in Quintania. The outskirts of our city and the underground have been infested with strange water creatures. You seem like the sort of person who would be capable enough to deal with these things from what I've seen. Yeah, I just I just killed all those monsters over there. And I'm sure the people of Jornheim and Eleanor would be grateful for your help. Pay those worlds a visit and offer your services. There's a portal to Jornheim in the caverns below Quintania, and a portal to Eleanor above the building you just came from. Okay. Two of my guards are at these portals. One is called Edmund and the other is called Baldrick. Talk to them. Okay, so what do we have to do? Quest completed, magic and mayhem, a new quest, Jornheim portal and Eleanor portal. Okay, so let's start one of the quests. Quests, we'll go to Alnor portal first. All right, talk to Edmund. All right, so this must be the water shrine towers. We have to find a way up this tower. Oh, I see Edmund. He's up there. Let's try and go to him. But okay, so we have to figure out a way to get up this tower like right here. Oh, there's a ladder. Let's head over here. I'm pretty sure this is over here, right? Okay, so how do we get up there? It looks like we have to go over here somehow. So let's just keep walking around and see if we can find a way up there. And then does that lead over there? Okay, it does lead over there. So we just got to jump over here. Do not fall. Oh my God, I fell. I'm so stupid. All right, we're back to where we were again. And now let's just make this jump. Okay. I sneak, make sure I don't fall off. And there we go. There's Edmund right here. Let's talk to him. Let's see what he has to say. Oh my, a traveler. I'm sure you've come here to look for the portal. Yes, I have. Well, head on to the magic portal and go check out this magical world. Oh, the Elnor portal. Okay. I don't know if we're ready to go on the portal, but let's check it out anyway. We've got a level three hydro wand. Where does this take me? It just takes me to a new spot. Lara. Who's Lara? Let's see what Lara has to say. Oh my, it's a traveler. I've been seeing so many travelers in the past days. It's insane. I wish I could tell you about all the good and happy things about Elnor, but at the moment, we're not in the best state. Corruption is taking over our land. Snow ice is spreading almost all over our islands. We're in danger, traveler. We need you to help us. I'll help you out and get you to where you can actually start helping us. We Feyans have wings and can technically fly anywhere. As far as I remember, humans don't have wings. You will have to find two parts of the lost wings, and if you bring them to me, I'll repair them for you, and you can use the wings to fly. Oh, that's pretty cool. Go ahead. They should be somewhere close. All right, so where would these be exactly? I hear like a dragon somewhere. I don't know what that is. Okay, you know what? I'm just gonna explore around here to see if we can find any wings. Let's, let's try traveling up these like mountains and stuff. Maybe we'll find something over here. Who knows? Let's go on top of this mountain thing and maybe it might be here. Please tell me there's something up here or else I would have climbed this thing for nothing. Maybe you have to go back to the other world and do like a quest or something to like find the wings. Oh wait, hold on. I saw something. I saw something. Okay, is this it? Please tell me this is it. Let me check. Let me check. Okay, 50%. Okay, so now we just need to find the left wing. Okay, so yeah, now we just need to find the left wing. Okay, where could that be? This might be a little bit of a challenge. So let's look for some. All right, I don't see... Oh, there it is. There 
it is. Okay, I found it. Bro, oh, I don't know why it took me so long to like go all the way around here to search for it, but okay. All right, let's talk to Lara. Let's see if she can repair the wings. Look at you. There we go. That's amazing. I'll get those repaired for you straight away. Once you've got them, walk up to the platform at the end of the island using your wings and fly through hoops. Okay, that sounds pretty cool. Good luck, traveler. It was nice meeting you. All right, do we have our wings now? Yeah, there we go. We got our wings. Unfortunately, we have to de-equip our armor, but you know, it's not terrible. Hold on a second. Before you jump, I've got a little challenge for you. What's your challenge? Of course, you can fly over there with your new wings, but you must fly through all the hoops. Not only will that give you the best experience, but it also brings you a big reward. Don't tell any of the others, but you'll be getting an air wand. Ooh, an air wand? Now hop off the platform and complete the electric course to receive it. Okay, I really want to get an air wand. So let's fly through the hoops. This should be easy, right? One loop. Oh, that kind of slowed me down. Oh no, what happened? Okay, let's just jump down here because we kind of need to go back. All right, let's try this one more time. Hopefully we don't like slow down because it's like slowing us down. Okay, there we go. We're not slowed down now. We're going through the hoops just fine and dandy. I'm like a god at Elytra stuff. So it's an easy task for me. All right, fly through here. There we go. No, come on. Yes, I got it. There we go. We got it. Oh, what was that? Oh, there's some like things over here. So we got air spears and air swipe. Okay, what does this do? Okay, they've got a lot of health. Oh my, bro, they're so strong. If we just like pin them in a corner, can we kill them? Bro, they're still at so much health, dude. They don't do a ton of damage to us, but we do a decent amount to them. It's so close. He was like so low, dude. There we go. Okay, what did he drop? I don't think he dropped very much. We got a lot of spirit from that though. Let's keep on going and see what we can get. I'm gonna use this central iron warper just in case. There we go. Okay, we got a new warp. That's good. Okay, we might have to go back because we're kind of very weak. If there are any high higher than level 15. I'm just gonna head back and do some of the other quests because they're probably really strong. All right, what is this? Okay, they're level 25. Okay, yeah, let's, uh, let's head back. So now that we're at the Central Island Warper, let's warp to, let's go over here. Let's go back to where we started. I wonder if there's like mobs I can fight over here. So I need to find a way to get more water essence. What about down here? Can I fight like some mobs down here? Oh my God, this cave is huge, dude. What level are these guys? These guys are level 10. Yeah, I can deal with level 10s. I can actually like spam my mana since I like regen it so fast. Okay, you know what? I'm I'm just gonna upgrade my stuff now because it's probably gonna save me a lot more time. We'll upgrade max mana again, level 10 for max mana, and mana regeneration is what we really need. Okay, let's keep killing them. All right, this means we should be able to use Whirlpool a lot more. Oh my god, there's like five of them there. I'm probably gonna get a water essence from this since there's so many. Come on, please. Was there anything? Oh, we actually got two water essence, dude. That's so good. We're getting a lot of spirit really quickly. This is good. There we go. Okay, we got eight water essence now. We should be able to upgrade our stuff. Can I get out of here? <laughs> I don't wanna be stuck in the water. There we go. Let's see what we can upgrade now. Okay, let's upgrade upgrade everything to level 10. Now let's upgrade our luck. I feel like our luck is a bit more important because I'm not really losing very much health. Now what next? Let's go for crit hit chance. We'll probably upgrade it one more time. We'll actually upgrade the crit hit damage. There we go. All right, this should be a bit better. Actually, hold on. I want to check something. Let's go over to elemental upgrades and let's check water damage. Okay, we can actually upgrade this. All right, now we do a bit more damage. There's actually a good spawn of axolandals here. They always get stuck in here. I don't know why they get stuck in here. They just do. Okay, please be water essence here. Okay, there's no water essence here. That's too bad. Actually, there was water essence. Okay, that means we can upgrade our stuff actually. All right, let's upgrade our stuff. So if we go to upgrade attributes and then elemental and then go to water resistance, now we take less damage from like all, all like water creatures, which is these guys. All right, so here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to upgrade all my attributes to level 10 and then upgrade my wand stuff to level 5 and maybe, yeah, uh, maybe like upgrade the physical wand. Oh wait, hold on. I actually see a warper up there. Okay, how do I get up there? Okay, so we'll head over here. There, we're so close to the warper. I think it's just like right over here and caverns warper. There we go. We've unlocked a new warper. This one is should be good for like grinding level 10 mobs. Let's upgrade some of our stuff now Let's just go to somewhere where they probably won't attack us and then let's upgrade some of our attributes So generic attributes. Let's go. Let's upgrade this to level 10 All right now, let's upgrade critical hit chance to level 10 as well max health I don't think our health is that important But we'll upgrade it anyway because it's not like we're close to dying But like you know what we'll just do it anyway since we have this spirit to do it So now all our stuff is at level 10. So that's pretty good I want to get one more water essence and then I want to see how much it costs to upgrade our wand all right, nah, there we go. Okay, we have 10 water essence now. We gotta work back to the uh, water shrine. Let's just, let's upgrade our wand. See, what do we got? Okay, so we can upgrade our wand to level four. Okay, and then how much does it cost? Oh, wow, that's actually just enough. Okay, we have a level five hydro wand. That's pretty good, okay. All right, now I think would be a good spot to end the video. It was pretty fun, I'm not gonna lie. Cubecraft, you've done a great job on this. But anyways, guys, that's gonna be in this video. If you liked it, make sure to leave a like and subscribe. Don't forget to turn that notification bell so you don't miss any single one of you. If you guys want to see more of this, let's let's just say 30 likes because I actually like playing this I'm not gonna lie. This is fun So if we can get 30 likes on this video, I will do a part two to magic and mayhem. Okay. <laughs> Anyways guys, that's me Over and out